Did you know that you can be in multiple places at once? It seems like magic, but it's possible with the power of quantum mechanics. See, quantum physics tells us that when we're not observing a particle, we cannot know exactly where it is or how fast it's moving. In fact, the more accurately we know where it is, the less accurately we know how fast it's moving. And the more accurately we know how fast it's moving, the less accurately we know where it is. But it's weirder than that. Because we don't just not know where a particle is, it's actually in multiple places at once. When we're not observing a particle, it splits into a wave of different instances of that particle, which then recombine into one once we measure it. We know this because of an experiment first performed in 1801 and refined many times since then. The double slit experiment. <sighs> Scientists took a photon detector and placed a screen in front of it with two slits, hence the name double slit experiment. They then took a whole bunch of photons and sprayed them at random at the detector. You'd expect this to result in two lines on the detector, but it actually results in a whole bunch of lines in what's known as an interference pattern. This type of pattern is what you'd expect from a wave, but it happens even when the photons are fired one at a time. This means this pattern appears not when photons interact with each other, but when they interact with themselves. This surprising behavior results in a whole bunch of other weird phenomena. For example, quantum tunneling, where solid can occasionally pass right through solid. It's rare, but at small enough scales, it can happen all the time. But the weirdest behavior, which even Albert Einstein himself refused to believe happened, is entanglement. In entanglement, a whole bunch of particles can become entangled, like these four aces and these four kings and changing the state of one changes the state of all the others. But the weirdest part is, scientists still don't know why any of this happens. There are plenty of theories, of course, from parallel universes to observer system entanglement. But nobody knows for sure. And that's the most exciting part, because that's how science advances. And until we know, it's basically magic.